everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing another Shein haul. Um, after my first one I was so so impressed that I decided to spend a little bit too much money on it and get some more things. Um, I'm very excited to show you everything I've got. I think you'll Before like Before I start, I just want to take a wee second to do a shout out to my friend's business. Um, it's called Lola's Lugs and they do super cute earrings. So these are a pair that I'm wearing and these are my favourites. Um, they're so affordable as well. I've got a field jewellery box full of them. Um, I absolutely love them. I'll bring it a bit closer so you can see how nice they all are. They're made of polymer clay and they have super cute little patterns. So I like this little pair, little boobies. Um, we've got some leopard print ones. Ooh, there we go. Some cow print ones, which I like. I think they're nice. And I do have another couple of pairs coming this week. I will link Lola's Lug's Instagram and Etsy in the description so you can have a look yourself. Um, you will not regret it at all. Um, they're just amazing. I really, really like them. These are my absolute favourite. I've not had an excuse to wear them yet, so I thought I'll fly them on today. Okay, so this is something that I've already opened because I was really excited to see it. It's a leather jacket, but it's a long one. Um, and it was meant to come with a belt. You can see the belt loops on it. And unfortunately it didn't come with the belt. But I must say that I contacted Shein on their you know, chat service and within minutes they'd helped me and they said I could either return it or they'd give me a 30% discount. And I, I still really like the jacket, so I just took the 30% discount because it didn't come with the belt, but I just thought they were so, so handy. Um, you know, they, were, they weren't they were sure why it happened, but they were really, really helpful. Um, but this is so, so nice. It had a bit of a smell when it first came, but after being with like other things, it doesn't smell anymore. But I just, I don't know. I just think it's, it's cool. Um, so I can't wait to try it on for you guys and for you to see. Okay, so this is the leather jacket and I really, really like it. Um, I'm actually kind of glad it didn't come with a belt. I don't think that I would wear it with a belt. I really like how it looks. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think this is maybe the more ex most expensive thing I've bought from Shein so far. Um, it was £38 or something. Um, but obviously I got 30% off, which... You can do the math. Um, but yeah, I think it's really cute. So I'm very impressed. Right, we have now got, now this could be one of two things. No. So this is a skirt. It is a midi skirt, I believe, yeah. So it's a mini skirt and it has, you know, a split in the side. Um, I do really like this. I don't think it's something I would normally wear. Goodness me, that's a candle, Come, we'll set it on fire. Um, and it's a little bit see-through, but I think it might look really nice with maybe like a jumper underneath, maybe that green one or something. We'll just have to see, and I'd probably pair this with my Doc Martens as well. Um, it looks like it'll fit as well. Apart from it being see-through, I really, really like this. I think this was maybe £7 or something, um, which I'm really impressed with. So we'll try that on soon. Okay, so this is the skirt. I am so, so impressed. You can't really see how short it is, but it is so nice. I absolutely love this. I wasn't sure if I'd like it. Um, you can see how see-through it is in my jumper is down to here, so you can see the line from where the dark to the light goes. But I really like it. I've paired it with a pair of Chelsea boots and my grey jumper. And I absolutely recommend, apart from it being see-through, you'd probably want to pair maybe a pair of shorts underneath, but absolutely recommend. So this is, and I can see by the pattern that this is a skirt. So this is a little plaid sort of skirt that I've got. Um, I really like this. It isn't the material I thought it would be. I thought it would be cotton. I don't know. I had an, an image in my mind of what it would be um, and that's not what this is. This is maybe like scuba or something. Um, but it's still really nice and it like flows really well so I'm excited to try this on. 
Okay, so this is the little plaid skirt. I really love this. Um, must say though, it's a little bit big on me. I've got a jumper on so it's fitting a bit better, but it's, you can kind of see how loose it is. And this isn't an extra small. Um, so it is a tiny bit on the big side. I might put a belt on it with it or something. Um, and again, I've just got it on with my wee Chelsea boots, but I do think it's super cute. I would definitely wear this out. Um, obviously probably with a belt, but yeah, I do recommend it. Okay, so next, this looks like my jumper. It is, um, I love this color. I think it is a beautiful color. It's like a forest green or something. Um, and it's just like a knitted jumper with balloon sleeves. I really, really love this. I'm excited to try this on. It's maybe a little bit more cropped than I thought, but maybe when it's on, it'll be fine. Um, the material is quite nice. I think it will do great for the autumn. So I am very excited to try this on. This is the green jumper and I am so, so impressed with it. I really, really like it. The colour is just amazing um, and it fits really nicely. Um, I'm not actually sure what size I got this in. I will have to check, but I am absolutely impressed and it's quite warm actually. I'm quite hot trying this one on, but yeah, I absolutely recommend. I will link this below. Okay, so I can see this one and I was going to buy this in a different colour as well, but by the time I'd went and placed my order, it was out of stock. So it is a shirt with a peplum, which I don't know. I just, I don't know what possessed me to buy it because I don't think I really suit shirts. I think it's probably the colour and the style. It's kind of got puffy sleeves a little bit too. And I don't know. I just think that this would look super cute with a pair of trainers and leather leggings. That's the look that I'm going for in my head. Um, hopefully it'll look nice on, um, but I really like that. I'm hoping that it'll come in the different colour. I wanted to get it in white with black. So hopefully it'll come in stock soon and I will definitely buy it if it looks nice on. But I am really impressed with this. The shirt material is, you know, shirt material, cotton. Um, and I just, I don't know. I just really, really am intrigued by this. So we'll have to wait and see. Okay, so this is the shirt and I really, really love it. Um, I can't wait to see if they have this in a white as well. But it just fits so comfortably. Um, I love the wee puff sleeves and the little peplum. Um, I do have this on with my leather leggings and my trainers, like promised. And I absolutely love this. I think I'm going Christmas shopping next week. So I think this might be my Christmas shopping outfit. Very happy with it. Okay. Now we've got, similar to the leopard print top that I've already shown you, it's a black and white giraffe maybe? I don't know. Um, yep, yeah, it's very similar. It's just a long sleeved high neck top. Um, this material is lovely. Again, it might not sound lovely and it might not be lovely. Polyester and spandex, but it feels completely different to the leopard print one, even though they're like the same materials and the same percentages. But I don't know what it is about this. It just, it feels amazing. I cannot wait to put this on my skin. Um, it seems again, good length. And I don't really know what I'll wear this with, but um, maybe I'll put it under a black dress or something. We'll have to wait and see. I'll see what I've got in my cupboard. My hair is a little bit of a mess from trying this one because it's tight on the neck. I was going to pair this with a dress, but after trying it on with my leggings, I decided that this looks a lot better. Um, yeah, I think it's super cute. I think this is something I would probably wear if I was to go out for a meal or something, or maybe for some lunch. Um, these are so see-through, I've just noticed. Um, and again, I have just paired these with a pair of my Adidas. Forgot what the name was for a second. But yeah, I think this material is so nice. It's very well fitting. Um, yeah, I'm very impressed. Right, I don't think that we've got very much left. Um, okay, so this is a pleated leather skirt, which I've seen a lot of things like it's in fashion at the moment. Um, I must say the way it's came, it's really crushed, which I'm not impressed with. And as well, because it's pleated and stuff, I don't know how I'm going to get the crushes out maybe I'll just have to 
put it in a room with a steamer or something. I just don't want to ruin all the other pleats. Um, but it is really cute. Maybe when it's on, it won't look as crushed. Um, I'm sure you can see just how crushed it is. Um, the material's not that great, but I didn't really expect it to be much different. It's kind of fell inside, which is a bit weird. I don't know if you can see that. But it looks like it'll fit and it looks exactly how it looked in the picture. So I'm excited to pair this with a couple of things. I do have some things in mind, so hopefully it will look good on. This is the leather skirt. Um, it is still just as crushed on, but it still looks super cute, I think. Um, I've just flung it on with the top that I've just tried on. Um, yeah, super impressed. Um, I really, really like it. Okay. Okay, so this, I can see it through the bag, is super cute. It's a high neck, long sleeve, liquid print top. Now, I really, really like this. Um, the material's actually quite nice. I don't know what it is. Um, polyester and spandex. It doesn't feel like that, I must say. It feels really, really nice. It's kind of soft. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to try this on. It looks thick as well, which I really like. Um, and it's cropped, but it's not like cropped, cropped. So I'm very excited to try this on, maybe with like a pair of leather leggings or jeans. Who knows? We'll have to wait and see. Okay, this is the leopard top and I am impressed. I really like it. I have paired it again with this leather skirt and I love it. I don't have anything negative to say about it. Okay, so next, what do we have here? I actually bought so much stuff I can't even remember. Oh, okay. So this is a dress. Um, okay, which way does it go? So it's a midi dress and it's just plain black, but it has the like kind of ruched. I don't know if that's how you say it. Um, with a little tie at the end. Um, I don't know, I just think it's really cute. Um, I'd probably pair this with um, my Doc Martens or something. Um, so yeah, very, very excited to try this on. Hopefully it won't be too long on me. We'll have to see. Okay, this is the midi dress with the tie. Um, I do really like this. It is the perfect length of midi for me. It's not below the knee because I'm fairly short, so sometimes it can be quite difficult. Um, but yeah, I'm absolutely impressed with this. Thumbs up. Okay, so next, this was kind of, not a joke really, but I just got these to match the earrings from Lola's Lugs that I've shown you, the cow print ones. Um, they're a pair of shorts. I don't actually know if I'll ever wear them out. I can maybe they'll wear them for like a Halloween or a costume party or something. But they match the earrings and I just, I don't know. I just kind of was possessed to buy them, I think. So I'm excited to try these on. The material is a bit crap. Well, no, no, it's not. It's just like fake denim that you get in a lot of shops anyway. Um, but, you know, can't complain. This is the shorts. Um, not sure what I was expecting, but not a fan, not gonna lie. Um, you know, they're all right. I really just bought them to match a pair of earrings that I got because they're very cheap. So they will do for that for a picture, but probably never gonna wear them in public. Not gonna lie. Okay, so the top that I got to kind of match that leather skirt is not actually a top, it's a bodysuit. Um, it is a mesh bodysuit and I don't know what, what the pattern is, swirls or something. I just think it's really different. I think it's really cute. I also have a pair of flares I got from Urban Outfitters and I just think I'm maybe very 70s when I'm wearing that. So I'll pair it with the skirt for this video or with my pair of jeans. Who knows, maybe both. I really, really like this. This is maybe one of my favorites actually. Can't wait to try it on. This is the bodysuit and I am in love with it. I think it is super cute. I've got it on with my flares and a pair of brown boots and I love it. I don't think there's anything negative to say about this. It's exactly what I was hoping for. So I'm very impressed. 
So another leather skirt. I don't know what possessed me with the leather, but I'm really, really liking it at the moment. Let's see. So this is a red leather skirt. I love it. I just, I don't know. I just, I just think it is so nice. And it's not like a tacky red either. It's kind of like understated. Um, the inside colour is a bit interesting. Um, and again, it's like felt on the inside. It must just be the fake leather that it is. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't know. I just think it is really cute and I think it will go with a lot. I do have a top coming up that is meant to go with it. Um, hopefully they will look nice together, but I certainly have other things that I can wear with this. So I'm very impressed. This is the leather skirt and I love this too. I think it is so cute. I think it'll go with a lot more than just this top, but this really goes definitely an outfit. So yeah, overly impressed. It is a bit thin, but you know what? Who even cares? So this is not really autumnal, but I do have an image in mind when I bought this. So it's, I think it's more of a summer top to be honest. Um, it's just this little top and it's kind of got a bit of peplum. Um, but what I was going to do was get a high neck white long sleeve top to put under it and then pair it with a pair of jeans or something. That was my plan. Um, it looks a little bit big. It might not be um, when I try it on. But looking at it, it does look a little bit big for me. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to layer this and see what will happen. It might look silly, but we'll try it out anyway. Okay, this is the little orange top that I layered with the white top. And I am very impressed with how it looks. Um, however, I don't know if you can see, but it really gapes at one side of the back. Which is very annoying. Um, if I can try and sort that, I'll definitely wear this. I've just paired it with a wee pair of jeans. Um, but yeah, I really like it, apart from the gaping back. Oh, that's an empty bag. Okay, this is... I think I had to spend an extra couple pounds to get free delivery or something. So I just picked up this little skirt. Um, it's just a floral skirt. I actually think this will be really nice for this time of year. It's kind of like a dusty pink sort of colour and it ha the flowers aren't too bright or anything so like with a pair of tights and maybe a white top I think it would look quite cute Um, it looks quite see-through I don't know if you can see how see-through it is no you can't really but I think I only paid a couple of pounds for this so I'm not I'm not going to complain to be honest you get what you pay for really don't you Okay, so this is the skirt um, and I really like it. I have paired it with a pair of boots and I think it's just a cute little, cute little skirt. I don't think it's amazing, but I don't think it's rubbish. I'll definitely wear it. So yeah, there we go. Only got a couple more things left. So this is, what is this one? Oh yeah, so this is like a long sleeved you know, I think it's meant to be like a jumper top, but it's too thin to be a jumper. I'll definitely have to wear a top underneath. Um, I don't know. Just thought it was a bit nice. Um, probably just to wear with a pair of leggings or a pair of jeans. There's no thread on there. But I do really, really like this. Um, apart from it being thin, you know, but it does have this cute little, I don't know, like a frilly sort of lace neck, which I think is quite cute. So I don't know, we'll just have to wait and see how it looks on, but I do quite like it. It wasn't very expensive, so can't complain. Okay, so this is the long sleeve top jumper thing. Um, I really, really like this on as well. You can kind of see how see-through it is. So I'll definitely have to put a little white top on underneath, but I do like it and I like how loose the peplum is. It's not like really loose, but it's not really tight. You know, there's some room to move. But yeah, I really like this. Apart from it being a little bit see-through, I think it is great. So the next two things aren't clothes as such. They're more of accessories. So I've got this bucket hat. Um, do not suit it. I have tried it on. <laughs> I'm not going to try it on again. But um, I mean, it will be super cute for people who suit bucket hats. It didn't really fit my head. It was slightly big. But it does have this super cute design on it. Um, it's like a little 
shooting star and a moon. Um, so that's why I bought it because I really like things like that. I've got my flares with moons and stuff on them. Um, but doesn't suit me. So if any of my friends want it, feel free to have it. Lastly, we have got just a bag. Um, I think this was maybe $3.99 or something. Um, I don't know, I just thought it was quite cute, maybe good for a night out. Not that I'll be going on any nights out soon because of COVID. Um, but yeah, it's it's a nice little bag. Um, the only thing I didn't like about it is that the straps aren't very secure. You have to tie them yourself and I feel like the little knots I've made aren't going to be strong enough if I put loads of things in my bag, like a phone and a purse. Um, but again, for like £4 or something can't really complain I think it is quite cute and um, so yeah there we go time to try everything on so thank you for watching Um, I'm sure that my mum or my partner watching this is probably thinking how much money have you spent Um, but oh well doing it for the videos that's what I'm telling myself Um, but I, yes thank you for watching Um, again I've had so much fun making these videos so far I'm hoping to make some more more often for you and um, I just need to try and figure out what I'll be doing and make more of a format to be honest and um, but at the moment fashion is my my niche that's what I'm hoping to do so please subscribe and thank you for watching